Hello everyone, welcome to Marty Motoring. This is a quick short video. As you can see, my hands are dirty because I am working on the timing belt on my Toyota Sequoia. I'm also working on my shop space. I moved some things around. We have another bay that we're kind of remodeling. If you saw the last video, um, that wasn't there. There was a wall there, we moved it. So building that out for my brother, his ISF, he can detail, park the car there. We have a lot of junk to get rid of and organize, uh, but I just built this and got the toolbox set up. And we have this set up and now I have some room to work on stuff. Got the table set up and a couple parts off of the Sequoia because I'm doing the timing belt. That's its own thing. I, I didn't really do a video on this so far just because it's there's so many online and I've just been really taking my time. Uh, I've been driving my other car. But what I wanted to talk about today is this grill. I got a lot of questions on it. Uh, so let's dive in. So 2001 to 2004, was a little bit more rounder of a grill. And then 2005 adopted this new style, just a little bit of a different design. Uh, but this grill is aftermarket and it really looks like the newer Toyota. So you get that like TRD look, um, you can get Raptor lights, has the V8 badge. And I threw this on for this is from Amazon. So I'll have that link in the description below as well as for the grill. Now this grill is made by a few different companies. I think it's, they're all made in China off the same mold. Uh, but this I got from Good Matchup. You can see the lines aren't like perfect. My paint is also not perfect. This thing has 300 something thousand miles, but you can see like it. the mold is pretty good. Um, this grill is a little flimsy and you do have to detach some of the stuff off the factory grill and put it on here. And there's no instructions, uh, but I mean, you can kind of see it's a little flimsy there when you push that uh, for the hood release, but it does work. The, what I find is just kind of pulling outward. You can see that flexes, just pull outward and push that at the same time and it comes up. Um, but it does look way cooler. I'll just throw in some pictures here so you can see it. But you can see it looks just a lot cooler, a lot more modern. And for 200 bucks, it, it seems like a little bit steep just because of the quality of it. But I mean, most grills are just plastic anyway. I wired them up to test them and then just didn't really have time to run them through the hood like they should be run. Um, so I just have a cable going here, here, and then connecting to ground and then into a fuse. So for those lights, let's see which one I used. I used the one right there, which that was the one I found that had constant power when the vehicle was on. But I actually have noticed they come on at night in the middle of the night because this is the ETCS fuse. So that seems to be a nice source for power for the red. And then you just, you know, ground the negative wherever on the body. I believe I have it grounded right here. Right now I have the battery disconnected because like I said, doing the timing belt, but I wanted to just jump in here and make this video while I had a few minutes and just show you the quality of this grill. There is another seller. I'll have the links that I can find in the description of the video. You can click on and buy uh, these links. I'm not affiliated with. Um, I don't get anything from them. I just want people to know how to get this if they want it. Now the Amazon one, I do get a very small portion of that because I am an Amazon affiliate, but it's, you know, I'm not getting rich here off of that. If you're interested in this grill for the 2005 to 2007 Toyota Sequoia, uh, definitely check it out. I think, I think it's good. Like it's, I'd give it three or four stars, definitely not five stars just because of the cheaper quality, but it does look a lot better than the stock one, in my opinion, and really updates the truck. Now the good matchup website, also has grills for the older models, Tacomas, 4Runners, everything. So there, there's a bunch of options on there. And this is the one I went with. For $200 shipped to my door really improves the front end of the vehicle. So that is going to be it for this video. If you found it helpful, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel and you want to see more Sequoia content, hit that subscribe button. Thank you for watching. And as always, keep those wheels turning. So long, farewell.